Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Young Sage here for a mod review this time. This is a weird one. This is called the Prestige, Prestige Sentry. It's supposedly some crazy car. There's too many tires, so this we might literally have to build this. We're just going to go for that. I don't want the stupid one. You know what? Why not? Let's Let's give it a go. We're here for silly shit, so why not? Yeah, we have a zillion tires we have to go through, so this might take a while because consoles are slow. Well, thankfully they're not. Okay, the mud tires are going to be wild. Yeah, it's going to be pretty wild. We have Quasi's mud. We have Quasi's mud tires, but they're not the monster mudders. We have these things. I don't know what the heck these are off of. Actually, these could be off of the Tatra. If I'm not mistaken, I'm not sure. You know, Quasi's monster tires look really strange on this thing. I'm just going go from MS, MS1s, because they look kind of right. We're just going to go for the... You know what, we're going to go for this, because I think this is going to be a big failure, so... Now, this is based on a Buick Sentry. The front end kind of looks like a Ford Contour, though. When it needs washing. This is a meme. I'm just going to tell you, this thing is a meme. It's not really well detailed. I doubt there's a really good interior based on how weird the windows look. Now the searchlight here is for is here for a reason. We'll put that on there and we'll try towing a trailer with it. See look, you get a police flasher bar. We're not gonna use that though. That's mounted awfully low. I can tell you that's off of something else. That is a weird choice. You know, because this thing kind of looks like a piece of junk. The mirrors are actually missing. I didn't even notice that. The headlights are taped off, it seems like. You know what? Why not? Colors are interesting. Now, there's a new mud truck from the TMB team, like Frogs Guys. I will be checking that out as soon as it releases. It has multiple bodies that are made by different modders. And it seems like it's going to be pretty wild. We have, an, we have an interior of sorts, but it's pretty shitty, so we won't spend too, many, too much time in here. Sounds pretty good. Oh, the amber lights are a cool touch. It can only tow scout trailers. It can't use any of uh, Red's trailers, which is to be expected. You know what? Just for the hay of it. Get a flatbed and let's put let's put let's put something on it. This is not the the the, the towing engine or anything. You can put a cabin on this thing. Yeah. 
do a couple of rocket assemblies. Oh god, that might be too much. It can barely move it. This is a crazy engine, so... Vehicle spare parts. Yeah, I can tell that. Yeah, the interior is... There, I guess. Looks like rubbish. The most detailed thing is the, is the box in the back. Is it fast? Whoa. Ninja Winton. You know what? That's a get over here moment. The lights have an interesting feature about them. This thing was made too quickly, I think. How's it doing the river? Ow! It's ripping over the trailer. <laughs> you know, we're having the same thing that we had with the, uh, with the Caterpillar CT380. I said it right this time. Do not give me no gun. I called it a 6A like as if it was a Kenny. Okay, uh, trailer, you can say there. We don't need you anymore. I don't know why someone would go to go, go through to make this, but I love off-road cars. I have, like, a thing for these kind of things. This is kind of a neat idea. I don't mind it. It's an old grandma car. Somebody bought probably for a thousand bucks. I just put some crazy shit in it. Solid axle swap. Uh, it's always on diff lock and AWD, by the way. Sound from that sound. You know what? That's the sound from the uh, from the Chevy Apache. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go build another one. Yeah, it's not gonna come out of there. It's stuck. There's no wheel, no wheels really touching the ground. It's a little thirsty. It says S, but this thing's losing fuel pretty quickly. Could build a police one, but there is no police livery. I don't know if that's a an omission that was necessary or something, but Put Quasi's mud tires on this thing, and we also have Quasi's chain mud tires. They're studded mud tires. We don't need that here, though.
That's a red beacon. Oh, it probably functions like a police light. Oh, yeah, these are Quasi's uh, default mutter wheels. Oh, and we actually can't put bobbleheads in here. We can hang shit from inside, which I'm actually shocked that they're letting us do that. Why is that so small? We're taking this way. I don't need to slog through that anymore. You wonder why I don't want to take my take any vehicles up the top? Now you know why. When they roll over or they get stuck, you're screwed. It's pretty fast. High gear is equivalent of fifth. Nice job, guys. All right, what do you got? It gets really badly stuck in the mud. Oh, please don't do this game. Oh, the low gear is like cheap code. Okay, automatic, it does not like the mud. In low gear, though, it does what it has to do. I guess we'll try the mud lanes. You know what? I want to see what these lights look like at night, because there's a lot of them here. Oh, God. It's like as bright as day. We almost never drive in the night, so let's just give it a go. It's not a mud truck, but it's serviceable. I have to say, though, it could definitely be better. For a mod with this kind of crazy power, I expect more. It says diff lock always on. It doesn't. I think always on trucks don't really feel as good as like engageable diff lock trucks. Sometimes I think it's a good thing, but other times it's a really bad thing. Let's take it down the dips. Let's repair that. As soon as we plunge in, we take. Engine damage. It's about the perfect wheelbase. I might consider this using this in the game. I must consider using this. Eh, if it was nicer, I probably would, though, but. I mean, it's a cool idea. I don't hate it. It's pretty good through there. I'm gonna try out Fro Frog's Volvo. Or I guess Frog's not Volvo. that all right hi oh 
little bit of a jump. Yeet. Well, it didn't even make it to the barrels. But it barely took any damage, so I guess I'll give it that. Durability is almost as good as it can be. It has the handbrake sound from the Chevy. Anyway, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this look at the Prestige Sentry with an S. It's kind of a, it's a cool little vehicle. It's not superb. It's, I think it's supposed to be a joke. Honestly, it's, it's a great idea. I don't mind it. It's a really dang good idea. I wish more of these existed. Hey, modders. More off-road cars. Please. Actually, I wouldn't mind seeing a few rally cars in the game, too, which we don't have any. Which, as of right now, I don't, I don't think there's any. I'll have a look. Anyway, guys. See you in the next video. Peace out.